guys! So I finally did it. I went and got myself a Hobonichi original, even though I have no clue what I am going to do with the Hobonichi original. If you follow my channel for some time, you realize that I use a Hobonichi cousin as my day-to-day -day planner. And I did use a Hobonichi original a in July of this year, but then I didn't enjoy it because there was not enough space in the Hobonichi original for my bullet journal collections. So eventually, I uh, I trans uh, I transferred uh, my daily planning to the Hobonichi cousin, and I've been enjoying myself with the cousin. So I probably will get the cousin uh, closer to the end of this year. So the question is, why did I get the Hobonichi original? And uh, the answer is a bit long. Well, to, to shorten the story, it goes something like this. So last week, I was preparing for class and I was very stressed. And so I took a break and watched the vegan organizer's YouTube video on her Hobonichi haul. And I saw this uh, cover and I had to get it. So I got it, and it arrived yesterday. So let me tell you a little bit about this cover. Uh, this cover is from the 2017 collections. It's not uh, the 2018 collection, it's from the 2017 lineup. So um, if you want this, I think you would. it would be good if you went and put in the order soon, because I don't think they would restock this anymore. So um, this is the from the 2017 collection. It's called Memories and it depicts scenes from a game called uh, Mother 2 uh, released by Nintendo in 1994. So in Japan it was called Mother 2 but in United States it was released as Earthbound. So a little FYI, I am currently playing this game. So after I bought this game, uh, I went to read up more about... Uh, after I bought this cover, I went to read up more about the game and I got my hands on uh, the game and I'm currently playing it. So I do recognize this scene from the game and I'm sure I'll recognize the other scenes as I progress through the game. Look at it! It's so cheerful! It's, it's such a colorful um, cover and I, I just could not resist it. I am so happy to, to have gotten it. So, uh, I'm not sure if you can see, but the inside pocket, uh, this side, has a different print than the outside. It's a red on black uh, print right here. I can't really decipher what it says or what it is, but it is a different print inside. So let me show you the insides of the cover. This is a brilliant lime green. It has a purple pen loop on the side and a yellow pen loop on the other side. There are some, um, some, some slots for you to put in your cards and then there are some side pockets as well on the back. This cover comes with a sticker by uh, this sticker is a Mr. Saturn sticker and it only comes with the 2017 version. So I intend to stick it here because look, he's so happy, he's so cute. So when I open this, I will be reminded to smile as well. So that's where I'm going to put it. Uh, your purchase will also come with a pen. So if you buy the book, it will come with a pen, which is the Uniball Jetstream pen. And uh, this pen, um, they give it with every purchase of the book. I also have a, like a die, uh, two dies to decide on your meals, but I don't have it here with me now. Let me go through briefly what the 2018 planner looks like. So on the first page is the yearly calendar. You have that current year, the previous year and next year. You have a yearly index page that runs from December all the way, all the way 
to, oh, sorry about this, all the way to March of 2019. Then you have the uh, month on two pages, the 2017, the December in 2017, all the way till March of 2019. Then you have two pages of blank grid, turning the page to a new year, where I presume you write your resolutions for that year and so on. And then uh, at the beginning of every month, you have a remember this page. And then this is the daily layout. And it lasts all the way to this point here where you get some extra grid papers. The extra grid, uh, you have about 15 or 16 pages, and then the extra stuff uh, that Hobonichi gives you, such as timetable, top 100, and things like that. Like graph paper, favorites list, top 100, and then extra information if you so wish. All right. The only difference between the 2017 and the 2018 version would be this part, where they, in the 2017 version, they have the English uh, word, March, first, before the kanji. Uh, but here you have the kanji before the English word. Uh, same for the other months as well. Yep. So I also got the weekly, and this is the weekly for uh, companion to the A6 because, as you can see, the Hobonichi, uh, sorry, the Hobonichi original does not have the uh, weekly layout. So you have to buy a supplementary uh, layout book. I've never gotten this before, so I was curious, so I got it. Um, if you followed the Hobonichi news, you know that the Hobonichi cousin, they changed the layout. They got rid of these th top three uh, boxes, and then it is now a 24-hour timeline. But they have uh, kept the boxes here in the uh, weekly layout, the supplement uh, to the Hobonichi original. I think the reason is that uh, it is already a 12, uh, sorry, 24 hour timeline. So you have 6 o'clock all the way till 5 o'clock right here. Each line represents one hour. So it's already a 24 hour timeline. So I guess that's why they did not have um, the additional, like did not expand it all the way up here. So um, for the weekly layout, you get the yearly calendar and then immediately you start off with the first week and then it lasts all the way to the last week of that year. So this is the last week of that year and then it gives you a couple of memo pages at the end. So this is what the supplementary weekly layout looks like. So uh, that is my small how for this video. I am going to, I'm thinking of putting up, uh, putting in uh, an order for the mega weeks when it is available and the Hobonichi cousin sometime in November. So I will um, have a how video then as well. So thank you so much for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Or good evening. Bye-bye.